Monday the 7th of January and um, yeah I'm at home today and um, I've got Ralph at home with me today so we're kind of gonna have a tidy up um, because I just want to kind of get back on the cleaning get back on detoying the house <laughs> because it's there are toys everywhere lots and lots of Lego um, boot camp started back today and I was planning to go to the 6am class because I have Ralph at home with me I didn't want to take him to the 9.30 and it will just like just take up like he'll just be stuck in the car and it just wouldn't be fair on him um, even though he'd have the iPad and but he can't, there's only so much he can do because there's no Wi-Fi there um, so yeah I just thought I was going to go to 6am class and then I, last night I was like I went to bed too late and I was just like the thought of getting up at 6 am to go to boot camp and then we had a bad night's sleep 5 30 i was awake so i could have actually gone but i was just absolutely shattered i don't know if you can see but my bags are horrendous um so i'm going to do a joe wicks workout at home um but i have i need to pay for the boot camp anyway so i need to sort that out because i'm only going to do twice a week i think i just got quite a lot on in january as you know um, i'm not going to be able to go on sundays um because i have stuff on and I just think twice a week would be enough for me. Plus, I can't really afford to pay for three times a week at the moment. Not till like February till my next pay packet. So that would be fine. Just because of just Christmas and everything like that. Um, so I'm going to pay for twice a week. Um, I may only go once this week. But it means I can go three times a week in other weeks. That's fine. Um, so I'm going to do that in a minute. Sort that out. I need to wrap something that needs to go be posted. Um, I also... Sorry about that, I had to get Ralph dressed. Um, so I'm just having a cup of coffee now. This is my second coffee. I've had my Hydromate. Um, that's my first one, I'm a bit slow today. Um, I'm gonna fill that up in a minute and drink that. Um, and I haven't had any breakfast yet, so I'll show you what I'm gonna have shortly. But first of all, I am gonna do a Joe Wicks workout because I need to do more workouts at home. I'm just relying on boot camp and maybe going for the odd run and things like that. And I do do workouts, but I wanna kind of do them more regularly. Um, so I'm going to do Joe Wicks this morning, just did a YouTube one that I sort of follow him on there. Um, there's one that he does at Niagara Falls, which is one of my favourites. And it's basically 20, I think it's 25 or 20 minute hit workout. So it's one minute on, no it's not, I can't remember what it is. It might be 30, 40 seconds and then 20 seconds off or 30 seconds off, whatever. Um, and it's all, every one is different, so you don't do the same 40 seconds or whatever it's 30 seconds again just do like so you might do like burpees so you just keep doing burpees for whatever time he says and then you have a rest and then it might be jumping jacks and everyone is different for the whole hit workout all right i'm going to do a weighted one of his it's just a kettlebell workout and then wednesday i'm going to do a, a boot camp just like boxing and that and then i'm hoping to go thursday early morning but if i don't i'll just carry that week that session over to the following week and do three sessions then um, I haven't got the gist of that <laughs> but yeah I just want to kind of get back into the routine of trying to do them at home I used to do them a lot and I've kind of slapped over the last few months um, but Bye. I will then have my breakfast after that so it's kind of like a fasted um, breakfast but without planning to be I just want to get my workout done and dusted and that's it um, read my weekend so if you follow my Instagram stories and I mentioned last week that I had a bit of a boozy one on Saturday night um, yeah it was a boozy one. Um, it was really, really like, fab evening. Um, there were some people that we hadn't seen for ages. We saw them and there was some of Sarah's family and her neighbours. And we just had a really, really lovely evening. And it was boozy. <laughs> I had Prosecco. I think I had three or four G&Ts. Um, a Sambuca shot. And a rum and coke. And I really really enjoyed it so it was probably well over my flexi sins because i had quite a few sins earlier on in the day but plus i also ate when i was there i didn't have any bread or anything like that i just had um some cheese um some brie and just a little bit but it, obviously it still all adds up some parma ham i also had um what else was it grapes celery so that's all speed um but it was just picky bits but it all adds up and it was probably well over flexi sins. Yesterday I was planning to do an SP day, didn't go to plan. Um, meal wise, I had my three meals, which are all on plan and you no know, slim and well friendly, but I was picking loads in the evening. I just don't know if it's because I was so tired. I wasn't hungover at all. I woke up actually feeling 
okay like I felt fine I just felt tired which is quite normal for me to feel like that um especially after a night out and being woken up by little ones um but I just I went to this kids party and I was picking there but I was picking at like the fruit and celery sticks and stuff like that so that was fine um I had a bit of popcorn which I sinned for I allowed that I probably over sinned yeah You did, didn't you? Do you want to come and say hello? I've got a... I've swapped Ralph for Woody. I can see. Say hi, Woody. Hi. What's your name? Woody. <laughs> Woody. We're into Toy Story now, aren't we? You've watched one, two, and I think... Possibly, have you watched Toy Story 3 yet? I don't think you have, have you? I did last night. I don't think you watched it last night, darling. I did when. Oh, maybe we back Sydney on Friday. You watched it. Yeah. Maybe we can watch it today. Yeah. 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 Um, Ralph's gonna go on the iPad for a little bit when I um, do my workout, aren't you? So Mummy can do her workout. Yeah. Yeah. Woody well, actually has an iPad. Woody has an iPad, does he? Yeah. Oh. That's what he. That's that's why he can play games. He can play games, can he? On his iPad? Yeah, he can play store. He can play. He can play. What's that? What's what? I'm just. I'm. Well, he can watch Toy Story on the iPad. Can he? Yeah, but there's Toy Story on there. Yeah, you can watch Toy Story on the iPad. Yeah. You can say bye bye to everyone. Bye bye! <laughs> <laughs> Sorry about that. Um. <laughs> um what was I saying? I can't remember what I was saying, so sorry about that. Um, yeah, so I don't know what I'm going to have for breakfast this morning. I will probably have something SP friendly. I'm not planning to do an SP day, SP day as such. Um, I'm planning to keep my sins low, so I'm planning to keep them under 10 sins. And I am planning to have an SP friendly-ish meals but are not not an actual sp day um uh, like for example i'm gonna tonight i'm gonna make the linda mccartney rosemary and red onion sausages i'm gonna cook them in like a tomato-y pasta sauce um like with lots of vegetables and things like that for the whole family and then i'll cook the sausages separately and then i cut them up once they're cooked um so they taste like little meatballs and i'm gonna serve mine with cauliflower Oh, the cauliflower rice I'll make or just I'll just steam the cauliflower instead in chunks and have that and then I'll serve everyone else's either with rice or pasta whatever they fancy um, and then I'll serve it with probably some healthy extra a cheese for lunch I've got I've got vegetable soup which is basically onions carrots sprouts which I had to use up the last of them now and what else celery that's the other thing in there so I made it yesterday for the boys dinner and I've got a portion left over for myself so I'm gonna have that for lunch today and I'll either have it with my healthy extra B or I might just have it as it is and just have it with some ham maybe um, and use the ham for dipping and things like that I just want to kind of like keep it SP friendly but I know the Linda McCartney sausages aren't and I want to keep it meat free Monday as well so I've waffled enough. I'm going to go and do my workout in a minute and I'll show you what I have for breakfast afterwards. So I'm going to do my workout now. I've just found um, a new series that Joe's brought out and it's literally 15 minute workouts um, and they're like beginner's workouts. But I think because I haven't done anything over the, the Christmas period as such, um, sort of bits here and there, not giving it my full attention, um, I'm going to start off with those. Um, so yeah, I'm going to start off with 15 minute today, 15 minute tomorrow. Um, and I'm going to do some weights as well, um, either today or tomorrow, I'm not sure yet. I'll see how this one goes. Welcome to workout number one, a 15 minute beginner's hit session with five basic moves. We're going to do 30 seconds of work on each exercise, followed by a 30 second rest, and we're going to do the whole thing three times. So here goes. So nice and high in three, two, one, good, and we're off. So we're marching for 30 seconds. Out, in, 
Think about the muscles we're using, your abdominals, not your neck. It's your abs, it's a tiny little move. Just hands, slow the screws, you got your thighs, to your fingertips, come to your knees. Breathing is important, so breathe in on the way down and exhale. As you come up in on the way down, exhale, last rep. Amazing work, right? Two rounds done. One to go. You know the drill now, the same moves. <clears throat> and let's go a little bit faster. So grab yourself a quick drink. We're going straight back in again to the knees. High knee mark here. And we're going a little bit faster this time just to show you to pick up the pace. Okay, three, two, one. Let's go, mark it. So knee, knee. Knee, knee, up, up, fast you can. Step it up a gear. Good. Remember, back straight. Bring your knee up as high as you can. You just feel that engage your abs. Ten seconds to go again. Knee, knee, up, up, quick. Three, two, one, and rest. Brilliant, so. We're now going back onto our start up together. So standing tall, hands by your side, feet together. This is the third and final round of star jump. So remember, you jump the feet out, and the hands come above the head, touch your fingertips, and then two together, hands by your side, and you can keep that. So it's up, down, like a star, as quick as you can in 30 seconds. Here we go, the girl's coming. Right, off we go. I love a star jump. You want to be doing it at school. Okay, we've got another 15 in the top. So can you go faster? Can you push harder? Can you get the top where you can hide? Right, here we go. Last 15 seconds. You're fine. Four, 
three, two, one, and breath. Brilliant, that was good effort, that one, good intensity. Good intensity. Okay, we're next, cut up the next up of the squat. Again, let's get right down on those squats. There's loads of muscles, but loads of energy. They're big muscle groups as well, body one, so let's get them working. We're going again in seven seconds for 30 seconds worth of squats. Okay, let's go down, up, down, up, down, up. Try and match that tempo for the whole 30 seconds. Down, up, down, up, good. Keep it down. And then the legs will be getting tired then for the last set. Final effort. And we've got those final two moves. And push. Come on. Three, two, one. And relax. Good effort. Right. Down on the ground then. And if you're wondering if I'm doing these with you, I'm doing these in real time. So I'm out of breath. I'm out of training with you. I want to get fit together. So here we go. In 15 seconds. Final set of push ups from the knees. And the aim here is to bend those elbows, get right down as low as you can and press and push up to your arm is straight again. Right, last set up you go down, up, down, up, down, up, good. Try and keep that nice, consistent tempo. Bend the elbows and push. Good, down, up, come on, 15 seconds to go. Bend the elbows, straighten the arms. We've got 10 on the clock. Let's try and get another five. Five. Come on. Four. Push. Three. Oh, I've counted. Push. Three. Just counted. Two. One. Right. 30 second reps. And we've now got our final exercise the ab crunches. So on your back again. Last one. Starting in 15 seconds. The final effort of the day. I've got a good little sweat on. Okay, here we go. Hands on the thighs. Crunching in three, two, and one. Off we go. Let's crunch. Use the ab to get your shoulders off the ground and your fingertips to touch the knees. Don't hold your breath, you've got to keep breathing on this one. Inhale the way down. Exhale as you crunch up. Five seconds. Come on, last few. Three. So that 15 minute workout is done. Um, if I'm totally honest, it's not enough for me. I wish I'd done the other one now, but um, I totally recommend it. If you don't do any exercise or you are okay, you do a little bit, but want to sort of get more into hip workouts, then definitely go and check Joe Wick's um, on YouTube. He's started at day one, I presume the 1st of January he started it, and he's on day seven now. So um, they're just mini workouts that you can um, like follow. But it's not high enough intensity for me. Maybe if it had been like 40 seconds on, 20 seconds off, it might be a bit better. But I'm feeling a little bit squidgy at the moment, so it's a good introduction for me. Um, but I will be, tomorrow, I will be doing his longer hit workout. Yeah, sorry about that. Um, <laughs> I just had to sort Ralph out. Um, yeah, it was good though. I'm still glad I did it. Um, but I will definitely be doing the longer session tomorrow. Um, I've just, this is my sec, I had half a bottle, whole bottle. So I've had two bottles so far, just over. Um, and I'll finish the rest of this off and fill up again, really for the rest of the day. And I'll show you my breakfast. Sorry, I'm just trying to catch my breath. So, I decided to choose my healthy extra beef for my breakfast this morning. Um, because I decided to make a mug cake. Um, I have done a video on this before, so I'll try and um, tag it up in the drop down box below. Um, in here I've got 40 grams of oats, which is my healthy extra beef. One egg. I've got half a teaspoon of baking powder, which helps, makes it rise. I've also got um, a teaspoon just under of vanilla essence, which is free. And I've also got a tablespoon of chock shop, which is um, two sins. 
So it's two and a half sins because the baking powder is half a sin. Um, it's actually half a sin for a teaspoon, but I'm actually using half a teaspoon, but I will still sin it. And then you also add two tablespoons of um, Greek yogurt, natural yogurt, whatever you want. I've got fat-free Greek yogurt here, which is actually uh, now a protein, so you can have this um, on an SP day. Um, even though I'm not doing an SP day today, um, I want to try and keep it as SP friendly. So um, I'm going to pop this in the uh, microwave for about 1 minute 30. I think that's what I did last time, but I'll put it on for 1 minute 30 and sort of see how it goes. And I'll show you what it looks like when it comes out. So here is my breakfast. Um, as you can see, it's all cooked in there. It did actually take over two minutes, about two minutes 20. I think it might just be my microwave. Um, but I've just topped it with some blueberries, which are a speed. I've also refilled my water bottle and I've got a coffee here. Um, which is also using my almond milk. I've drank quite a lot, about 400 mils comes up to about here. So I've used quite a lot of my milk today already. So I'm gonna save this for a cup of tea or two later on this afternoon and this evening. Um, and that will be um, my milk done. Um, but if I want any hot drinks later on, I'll just either have some of the winter spice Ribena, which is free, um, cause it's got no sugar in it, or I'll just have a herbal teas. So here is today's lunch. I've got the soup that I mentioned, which is packed full of speed. I'm serving it with some little mini muffins that I put in the oven just now. So it's got in here, we've got red onion, courgette and mushroom. I've used four eggs and it made six. So I'm going to save the other two for either later or tomorrow. I've also got some bacon in there, which I fried off as well. And I also use seven Thai spice to give it a little bit of a kick. Um, I didn't add any cheese or anything, so um, there's no healthy extra in there. But I'm going to use those for dipping in my soup today. So I'm just going to have a cup of tea using my almond milk. Um, I've got enough left for about another cup, of, another two teas, and then probably save those for later on. Um, and I'm just going to have a milk chocolate fiber one popcorn bar, which is three and a half sins. It's nearly two o'clock, so I'm going to have this, and then I've got the pick up to do at three. So. Uh, so keep me going till then at least anyway so after i um did my workout earlier i dyed my hair again using the same dye and it has made a difference actually um it has lightened it so it's still a little bit red um but it has lightened it quite a bit so i might just leave it now um yeah i think that might be the best thing to do um ralph's just on the ipad at the moment i'm gonna have my cup of tea and my bar um he doesn't normally go on the iPads on a Monday, but he's managed to wangle some time out of me. So, uh, but he's just going to go in it for a little bit, and then um, we're going to do some drawing or something like that. Um, yeah, I'm just going to sit down. I've got work tonight. Um, in fact, I might prep dinner in a minute actually while he's on there and um, get that done. Um, so it's all ready to be cooked or start cooking it anyway. And I can cook it when Sydney gets back from school and um, it'll be ready for their dinner. And then me and Darren have ours um, later on. So, yeah, I'll uh, speak to you later. So here is tonight's dinner. In here I've got onion, mushroom, leek, courgette, tinned tomatoes, vegetable stock. I also use spice and thyme marinara seasoning, just to give it a little bit of a kick, um, but not too much. I've also got some leftover, I don't know if you can see, green lentils which were tinned green lentils um, just to add some protein and use them up I've got Linda McCartney um, red onion sausages which I cooked in the oven and then I chopped up once they were cooked um, into um, the, the sauce um, which are free and I've served mine with about a third a head of a cauliflower um, so that's speed as well and I've got 15 grams of cheddar cheese um, so that's half one of my healthy extra A's. I have got the other half, which I probably might just might just make milky coffee um, for this afternoon before I go to work. It's now hot, nearly half four. So um, yeah, I'm not gonna have this now. I will save this and um, pop this over here. Darren, he's got the same, but with pasta. And um, I'll have it for my dinner when I get in from work tonight. So it's nearly five o'clock and I'm just having a coffee and it's quite a milky one. So I use the rest of my healthy extra A. So I still have 200 mils left of um, almond milk now, which is my half, my second half of my healthy extra A, if that makes sense. Um, so I'm having this and I'll have 
the other milk if I want to use it um, for a tea or two later. And I'm just having a Hi-Fi Choc Orange, um, which is three sins. That takes me to nine sins so far. Um, and then I'll have my dinner tonight and I'll probably have it, I may have a little treat afterwards, which will probably be frozen fruit and some quark, which I'll speed them with some skinny syrup. But if I do, I will show you. Um, but yeah, I'm just gonna have this now. I have also had my two muffins as well, because I was getting a bit peckish. The ones that I made at lunchtime, I had two spare, so I had those as well. Um, but yeah, I'm just gonna have this now. So I've got some defrosted summer fruits, um, which were frozen, which are all speed, and I've served it with some Greek fat-free yogurt, which is a protein, and I'm mixing a teaspoon of salted caramel skinny syrup. So this is my little treat bowl for tonight. Um, so I'm ending the day on nine sins. Thank you for watching everyone. Hope you've enjoyed this video and I'll speak to you all very soon. Take care. Bye.